It is so important, Judge Jeanine, that we are fighting to get this memo released to all of the American people. I don't think the right answer is just to allow members of Congress to be horrified and outraged. All Americans need to see what was happening to undermine this president how duly do we, elected. How do we release this information? How, when do I get to see it? Well, at any moment in time, the intelligence chairman who has done an excellent job, Devin Nunes, can schedule a vote in the Intelligence Committee. If the Intelligence Committee votes to declassify this information and if President Trump doesn't overrule that it will immediately become available to the American people and when our is government. Devin Nunes going to schedule this for a vote? Well, he said he wanted to hear from more members of Congress. Sixty-four of us have already oh, sent him a letter. The phone. You well, can do that in an hour. I, I spoke to him today on the floor. This is so important, so shocking, it should be public immediately and we're pressing tell the time. Me, to tell Congressman Gates, I can't wait to read it. Hopefully soon. Two weeks? I'm hoping sooner. Good. All right. What is so important is that we get this information into the public square. Yeah. The best disinfectant for this corruption is going to be sunshine, and that's why Jim Jordan and I have joined many other members of Congress in calling for this information to be released for the review of all of the American people. And it is absolutely essential that we share it with all Americans. That's what we're fighting for in the Congress. The key reason that all Americans need to see this memo is that it names names. It says who was involved with who, how different actors and characters we've heard about interacted with one another, and that is the type of information that we need all Americans to see immediately. I've been watching my Twitter feed and I've been watching Twitter all day and I'm seeing hashtag release the documents, hashtag release the documents everywhere. And the American public deserves to know the truth here. Congressman Jordan. Yep. We deserve to see this. You sure agree do. with that? And how soon will we be able to get so our here, eyes on these documents? The pro yeah, great question, Sean. Here's the process. Chairman Noon is in the Intelligence Committee in the House. He can bring the committee back together. They can have a vote. If a majority of the committee votes to release these documents, the executive branch gets a certain amount of time to review them. If the executive branch gives the thumbs up, they go public. So this could happen real quick. Chairman Noon is, is committed to getting this information Not to the public. Not one Democrat wanted you to see it. Well, no, they didn't. But I can after you read it and you see, and if they're playing partisan politics, you can see why they didn't want us to, to see that. And you can see why they won't want the American people. But as Matt Gates said, as Sarah said, this is something that needs to be out. So the, this should never happen in a country as great as the United States of America. And we need every single American to take a look at this and see what exactly their government did, their law enforcement division did. This is this is that kind of information. And it needs to be public as soon as possible. We have to underscore the point that you and Jim Jordan just made. Every single Democrat on the Intelligence Committee voted against even allowing other members of Congress to see this information. So you know they're going to fight against release to the American people. What are the Democrats so afraid of? Why don't they want the American people to know the truth about what was going on with the government, how that impacted the president, his transition, his campaign? And it just seems interesting to me that Democrats don't want us to know what the entire basis was in the first place for the Mueller probe. They want to drag this out through the midterm elections to try to embarrass this president and distract this Congress from the critical work we've got to do to save this great country. Without Let's release the documents. Any details. When the American people see how this began, when the American see people see how different people interacted with one another, how organizations were infected and infiltrated and subjected to tremendous bias of individuals and how that really played out, I think that every American will understand how absolutely ludicrous it is that we continue to allow the Mueller probe to go forward. It needs to end because the entire basis is a lie. When this document goes public, which I believe it will, I do believe it will be the unraveling of the Mueller probe. The investigation at the Intelligence Committee is not complete. Thank goodness for what Devin Nunes and his committee are doing and the push they did on the Justice Department to get these documents in the first place. So, but there is more information. Their investigation is not complete. When it's complete, then you're going to see the Judiciary Committee Comey? in the House do even more. Today we're calling on all Americans to be able to see this material so they can see what really took place. Hey.